Hey, welcome back again, viewers and subscribers. At this moment, I just want to speak to you on um, Russian calm free. Um, I have, in fact, um, found um, that um, species, that that variety. Um, calm free, as I did in the last video, um, I said um, it's also called knit bone, um, which is good for um, healing. Um, told you about its history, um, being used um, to um, to mend bones, and. Um, just like uh, the other uh, species, um, this one um, you have to be um, very careful with the pyrolizine um, alkaloids. Um, in 2001, the FDA issued a issued a ban, a warning against um, its internal use, ingesting it because um, it can cause liver um, toxicity. So um, here is um, Russian comfrey, Simphytum uplandium. You see the um, purple flowers there, right? And um, the lens um, shape um, leaves, different varieties of different. Um, colors of um, the flowers, um, hairy leaves and um, hairy um, stem, there it is, uh, so I got quite a lot here, right, and um, there is um, this um, substance called allantoin, right, um, in um, the roots, um, which helps with um, skin cells, um, growth of um, skin cells, and um, it's also, it also contains rosmarinic um, acid, um, which helps with um, inflammation. And um, also, um, back in the 1980s, it was called um, the fastest um, protein builder because of um, its roots, um, its restorative um, properties. So um, it's pretty um, interesting. It also was called a wonder plant, right? Um, so you've been using Japan for uh, over 2,000 years. It's a um, pretty amazing um, plant. Um, pretty, pretty incredible um, plant. Uh, but um, Today, it's mostly used like in you know, ointments, salves, pulses applied um, externally um, to the skin. Um, but um, even um, traditionally, for um, since ancient times, it has been used um, to treat um, digestive um, ailments, digestive issues. Um, let's see, menstrual um, issues also are uh, heavy, um, heavy periods. Um, treat um, blood in the urine. Also, um, treat um, pleuritis, uh, painful breathing even tree cancer even um also um treating um diarrhea also um so pretty um pretty interesting even um arthritis um gout yeah pretty interesting uh, it is even um down here you see it all the way down here too yeah so um, pretty pretty um <coughs> pretty um pretty amazing in the Borigine family Boriginaceae family um it's a um perennial um herb can even grow up to um five um five feet um tall as um as you see um here we um we have it here but it's um it's quite a beauty uh, hairy leaves hairy stems beautiful um, beautiful flowers yeah, it's um, it's quite um, quite something else there. Um, it's um definitely a plant that you need in the garden. Um, provides um potassium, nitrogen, those are nutrients um that will help plants um plants grow, helping them in their growing stage. Yeah, um, makes um a good uh, potash fertilizer. Um, you just uh, cut the the leaves and the roots. Um, put them in water to soak. Yeah, yeah, definitely one of those plants. Um, they say it's the best. Yeah, say it's um, it's the best plant that you need um for your for your garden. So if you're into gardening, yeah, yeah, you need um, you need Russian comfrey um for sure. So yeah, that's um, that's it. That's it for now. Yeah, Russian comfrey.